everyone. Today's Easter Sunday, and we're going to start by singing In the Garden in Navajo, stanzas one and three. Good morning. Uh, this morning, a uh, announcement to a less uh, behatsi. Ah, do the more he ne kagi di da nchenal do bi e the more the tsa da do sni lunch or kisiki do e ah e ya do na ki. Church member at Kinya, the Halia, those louder than the sa. It I said, I hot out a daughter, and how could I have the old English out of the saddle? Corners, uh, the course and saggy, or you had no, but a bit that is not she is daughter. I don't know, he cared us on the banda or can't or never care. Pray for uh, all church members and their families, essential employees, those that are sick with uh, COVID-19. United States, Arizona, and Navajo Nation leaders, and pray for a revival uh, in our time. And then we have a birthday coming up for Cindy uh, on the 24th. And then remember to send in your ties if you're a member of this church. And so. Well, begin here this morning, and I hope you're ready, and it'll be good, and I'm ready. And uh, so, 
But we're going to turn our Bibles to the book of uh, Acts. And uh, it's going to be chapter 26 and verses uh, 16 through 23. So we'll uh, probably read uh, uh, a little ways and then we'll pray. Uh, it says, uh, But rise and stand upon thy feet, for for I have uh, appeared unto thee for this purpose, to make thee a minister and a witness both of these things which thou hast seen and of those things in which I will appear unto thee, delivering thee from the people and from the Gentiles unto whom now I sent thee to open their eyes and to turn them from darkness to light and from the power of Satan unto God, that they may receive forgiveness and inheritance among them which are sanctified by faith that is in me. The Gabaza Paul Abitra Apostle Paul the <laughs> A pico ado on the tea or tlap and nash eh? A tatigino, a tabat to a nish nila. Word of prayer, Heavenly Father, we ask you to help us again this morning. <clears throat> Bless, uh, for we thank you in Jesus' name. Amen. Okay, amen. The, the title of our message, if we have it on the there, it is uh, uh, staying on schedule is the is what is called look uh, at verse 2 he said I think myself happy King Agrippa she ya she was no dancer's case, Nila. A court or in a great John be it a hot out, so be her or three John slat tart at the door. A slat the haggy ain't no for I have given unto you an example that ye should do as I have done to you. Verse 17 If ye know these things, happy. Are ye if ye do them, Nila? You know that. You know I'm. I'm happy. You know that you ought to be happy. You ought to be happy for a reason. You know circumstances do uh, come up, and uh, circumstances can be wrong. But hey, I'm happy that I'm going to heaven. Uh, my name is written in the book of life, and uh, I'm a blood uh, washed child of God. And you know, Jesus is coming again for me. And uh, he, he will receive me, and uh, I have victory in him. And then uh, he's preparing a place for me. Apostle Paul, Jesus, a a copen hit where snaggy a a bit of all join his the hojot or less what they knew what I knew. Joe was hojot or less at each bar hojot or plans as link or a hot edo. A cohote a co a shed dancer's case or a yard digging grat a yard 
So uh, each uh, feast days uh, were to be observed throughout the year. The feast days, if observed, would help his people stay on schedule spiritually. And uh, getting right with God meant sacrificing a lamb. And staying right meant keeping the schedule or keeping the feast. Each uh, feast represented something that Christ did uh, or will do for humanity in the future. Of course, I did, uh, uh, have not talked on these feast days, but uh, uh, to simplify, I'll uh, give you uh, some. Of course, I have Just uh, what our in schedule hal eight out a little schedule bad alian de a cohorting in carpets and store grass of cares dos nizzle to eat a pay as an artist and hint a add on that the in carpets are cooked out to asho to eat it a night uh tatanal and dal in higgy eight hours so the catches on a cut out a Eating cups Concerning salvation in verse 18, uh, to open their eyes and to turn them from the darkness to light and from the power of Satan unto God that they may receive forgiveness of sin. That's an important word, forgiveness of sin. You know, that's the need of the hour. The ultimate need in this nation is for somebody to receive to have uh, their sins forgiven so they can go to heaven. And that's what they did. And so uh, this, uh, this feast here is called the Feast of Passover. Uh, that feast was intended to remind the people of God what Christ did for them concerning salvation. Uh, the name of this feast is the Feast of Passover. The, pe- the Feast of Passover. The this, uh, uh, actually uh, relates to the salvation. So First uh, Corinthians 5, 7 will give you that. Perch out therefore the old leaven, that ye may be a new lump as ye are un- unleavened. For even Christ, our Passover, is sacrificed for us a salvation style Christ at his death. So ye la ko ebenina. Go to Exodus chapter 12. And we're going to. Uh, you don't have to uh, open if you can't find it. But I'll read it to you from there. And uh, that's actually 12, verse 5 and 6. Your lamb shall be without blemish, a male of the first year. Ye shall take it out from the sheep uh, or from the goats, and ye shall keep it until the fourteenth day of the same month. And the whole assembly of the congregation of Israel shall kill it in the evening. And then uh, look further down at verse 13. And the blood shall be to you for a token 
or a sign upon the houses where ye are. And when I see the blood, I will pass over you, and the plague shall not be upon you to destroy you when I smite the land of Egypt. Nila, a cohort the Bayazna honey, so ill in the sun be it. A cohort the Bayaz or Chen Baho or Shah's Baho, or had other banter has all things that his cartridge. Nell ego ad on ta e yat at a nido at a la in a bazato kis over the stairs go e tatel cassacoche at such a pahajis in doko what down on in an adato e yaque at any a co e yak be a hosen titus e ya e be a hosen do hagishina na ad on ta at a nila tisis sago. In heart, he stays sharp. I do the nasty hickey, a yato, tin hit or little, and hard or snitter. Hala a bed, he a slate or nila, a court or a you know, when he, uh, the Lord uh, saw that blood, uh, nobody died in that house. And uh, so that was Passover. A court teacher, so a what art that. Uh, a tal kasmahal yago e bit doesn't know nothing, e doesn't know nothing, so e yahal and e a court to a Jesus a pass over and has a lay a corn hit or do don hand the hot or aldo chindi trout at the crata, so e see yahal pass over is telling us that if we believe the Lord to save us, we're not going to go to hell, we're going to be in heaven. Because of what he did, he'll pass over us concerning hell. Uh, he's not going to send us there. Even in that, ah, so he ya be pahan ne ko to aldo ta. He ya os be hozano so it ah hon ne to le. I don't that Ephesians be git the nana sa sa nana so it on it change to to le. Ephesians chapter one and verse uh, seven says that uh, to. In him we have redemption through his blood and the, uh, the forgiveness of sin according to the riches of his grace. So the blood, uh, when it's uh, put on the door, uh, signified that, uh, that, that the destroyer is not going to destroy you. Uh, he's just going to pass over you. So you know that day you... Uh, Believe the Lord, trust the Lord, uh, you are set for heaven. You're ready to go to heaven. What a day that is uh, to know that, and you should be happy about that. And you know, that's why Paul said, uh, I consider or uh, I think myself happy uh, uh, that, that, that I know this, that the Old Testament uh, ritual that these people went through was actually talking about the coming of the Lord. According to the Son, we get that now in the bands of Kaya, so it's Jesus or Gothic Yahad. And according to number two, verse 18 again, uh, it says, uh, Inheritance among them which are sanctified by faith. That word, which are sanctified by faith. That is in me, nila sanctified by faith. So it ah no ayat ah te te ligeno te ligeno alia. So ha no ha ne at al te te gin ka chui to in te get ao ila. So hot ao te gin. So hot ao ni ke te ilia ke ayat the feast of unleavened bread was a uh, uh, this uh, sanctification. Uh, that he was talking about the Feast of Unleavened Bread. Uh, uh, this uh, feast was to remind the people of God what Christ did for them concerning their sanctification. According to God, so he had his tawas kyo, he had his tawas kyo, he had a coho e arge, a punch door, and a spatcher chon, eat or less, so e cut out in the yen hon, chon, a coho e yahal, a coho de feast of unleavened bread, or lie, a cohasha lay, 
First uh, Corinthians is not an ill, is I need an ill. First uh, Corinthians five and verse eight, or less, Lana, that we read over there before. Therefore, let us keep the feast not with old leavened bread, old leaven, uh, neither with the leaven of malice and wickedness, but with uh, unleavened bread of sincerity and truth. A court on it again, it's a hunt, chon, cho in chong or kidnapajo, cotton, kidnapanjo, raha, it will be not in that. A court, if you are sanctified by the Lord, uh, you cannot be a, a continual sinner. You can't practice what you used to practice in your old life. You're, you're actually sanctified to be a holy vessel for Him, and uh, so that's why it should be different. Uh, when you live a life uh, from here on, and look at verse uh, 11, uh, 6 11, actually in the same chapter. Uh, and such were some of you, but ye are washed, but ye are sanctified, but ye are justified in the name of the Lord Jesus and by the Spirit of our God. That's 1 Corinthians 6 11. A nato ni the que aya kitata no teher a ya chon atachlan it signal de hinde tan e hinde no ye ha kwata no tene konakade tadan hit the skis do a don the delgin olia a kwaki at ego Jesus Bishop be a don chitigin pe cho no ye ha zi a ko ebenina a koti na in ni a pa the tick was my hat for hat and we done again. A honey, a quay, a yatel delgin, so a bahan and a co ebony na. A court or lot that that's that's a day, co a first John, a quay nand or the first John three three. A court is up. First John three three. So I I I am not a call and every man that had this hope in him purified himself, even as he is pure. So it's Jesus. First Peter one eighteen or nineteen. Do what in be ye holy, for I am holy. Na a call to you. They get no extra house king or they get no ever as change a lead or the so a yahad and the deep the party cons bahat and on a honey hickey a hot and the other con a that the third thing that that is to happen is uh the the feast of the Pentecost a quiver 23 in Nila look at verse 23 uh back at uh Acts 26. Uh, that Christ should suffer and that he should be the first that should rise from the dead and should shew light unto the people and to the Gentiles. Notice he said, unto the people, meaning the Jews and Gentiles, those the people that were non-Jews, uh, they, he wrote to them that there would be uh, actually be a light uh, to them, uh, and then uh, if you have a light, then you would uh, have that uh, unity, uh, walking and seeing in in the light of the Lord. That was the feast of Pentecost, feast of Pentecost. A di tagon a Pentecost or. And he get a quite a hina il tahot up at the yen a bada ching yaki a ya jo a deed ya had naki a this was to remind the people of God what Christ did for them through the Holy Spirit concerning unity and they were to share with all believers so a what out a ya panacos a big it all. So a sa itli ya had na ko a so a Acts chapter two the ah that all says we have been there before chapter two verse one you know the that's when the Holy Spirit came and so chapter two verse one says and when a a day of 
Pentecost was fully come. They were with one accord in one place. Né? One accord in one place. It says all. All. One accord in one place. So, né? unity, a call a an etza Philippians chapter one verse twenty seven Adanand or less one twenty seven. Uh it says uh, now let your conversation be as it becometh the gospel of Christ that whether I come and see you or else uh, be absent I may hear of your affairs that ye Stand fast in one spirit, as the word one spirit, with one one mind, striving together for the faith of the gospel. That's another one. That's in a, the faith should be one. It's not a mixture of uh, different uh, ways of believing. So you know uh, that that was the reason there should be one unity uh, as a Christian. Even in Nana Hashan First Peter. Chapter three and verse eight. Nana, ah, this eight. In other need or let look at uh, First Peter uh, chapter three verse eight now, and uh, see what uh, it will tell us there. And finally, be ye all of one mind, having compassion one of the other, love as brethren. Be pitiful, be courteous. Nela kong eya. A kid bends, a kid a sabbins at a kiss. I don't, uh, a art and no son of a kidden's now a trend and not eh. I don't, uh, yo, yo, da he no, no, a hot eat and no son of. I don't, a trick at a not son, don't let you know ye had see. And then chapter four and verse three, uh, there it says, uh, for the time. Past of our life may suffice us to have brought the will of the Gentile when we walk in lasciviousness, lust, excess of wine, reveling, banqueting, and abominable idolatry. Nila, a conda so a cat a yasa hotza a needle at this stage so a bahan a you know that that is uh, I believe uh, that's where it should be uh, uh, almost there but uh, that's not the last one I wanted to uh, mention actually the next uh, thing that will be is uh, the fourth one is the feast of first fruit oh yeah Feast of first fruit of Yego Eya, a sunnest honey, a penina, a tanigi, pes a tanigi, a yat, that was to remind God's people what Christ did for them concerning the re their resurrection. Their resurrection. You know, Jesus also arose again, and you know, that's uh, our salvation, but uh, also. Uh, we're going to rise again. If you're saved, born again, uh, you'll go to heaven. Uh, look at verse 23, back at uh, Acts chapter 26, verse 23. It says that Christ should suffer and that he should be the first that should rise from the dead. And should, uh, so uh, he's the first. Notice the word first that should rise from the dead. Nah, first, nah. First fruit. So in late, uh, I will read the verse on that uh, later. But uh, but uh, here, uh, first fruit. So first, uh, no. Ascent, uh, ascent, uh, ki e ben nasa na in ni hindi ben nasa na hatlande. So e piyahan na, yahat na ge sa atse. 
Enan hit the doll ja, Johanne. A court sennest, Anneke epicane, Anna doja. Johot as in Sahakis, a keep in certain seas case. Doll less, a call first Corinthian fifteen and uh, chapter fifteen and verse verse uh, twenty, I think twenty, yes, twenty through twenty three. Uh, but now is Christ risen from the dead and become the first fruits of them that slept. For since by man came death, by man came also the resurrection of the dead. For as in Adam all die, even so in Christ shall all be made alive. Every man in his own order, Christ the first fruits, afterward they that are Christ at his coming. That's a uh, important you know that he's the first fruit so if you have a first fruit you're going to have the next fruit that's going to come and that that's where he puts us in we are going to follow because the first fruit had come Joko in Hito, Nada de Dath, Jo e hat no hatne, Akoho ebenina. Eight or look at what a day it, it is for you to know that, that you, can, you are going to heaven because he's risen. You know, today is the resurrection day. Aho Easter, the Oliado resurrection day. You see, uh, Bishi, Jo e Nadi Je Bahane. Jesus not eat the ani Easter yeah a ya a a ya shi ya si bin ya uh the deoji in the quantit an nature a cheese and not eat the a bahan a koho in hit or a hot a non hit the doll jahot a shon hit the no hot ne Jesus not eat the out at the first Corinthians la at the hagi and no a cheese or not eat the go in hit or not at the jata Jesus or not eat the or not or not a need a no ya ya ski Echo Ibn it's important to know that uh, there is uh, the resurrection of Jesus. If he, he rose from the dead, we will also rise again at, at his coming. And uh, so, a question. Hold this. Echo Ketna in the A. 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 And uh, uh, this is uh, concerning the regathering of Israel. And A.A. Yata, verse 22, and then go back at uh, Acts 26, 22. And having therefore obtained help of God, I come on, continue unto this day, witnessing both to the small and great, saying none other things that those which the prophets and Moses did say should come. Prophets and Moses did say should come. So the coming had seen to what all this. So what all need eh? A the a ya bahas natchanila. A this was to remind God's people what Christ would do for Israel concerning their future. Uh, regathering as a nation after the rapture you know that that's what uh, you know the world uh, may be in tension this, this afternoon this morning you know there's a uh, chaotic uh, uh, activity surrounding Israel and uh, that's just saying that, that he's coming uh, it's uh, drawing a closer because uh, the evidence is that uh, Israel it's going to get real strong. It's going to, they're going to come back together. Uh, before they do, you know, uh, there's one event that's going to take place. We're going to take off from this uh, old earth and go to heaven. First Thessalonians uh, 4 and verse uh, verse uh, 13. 
Ah, the Anil I would I would not have you to be ignorant eh? brethren concern them which are asleep in other words they are in the grave at death that ye sorrow not even as others which have no hope for if we believe that Jesus died and rose again even so them also which sleep in Jesus will God bring with him for this we say unto you by the word of the Lord uh, that uh, settles everything, that we which are alive and remain unto the coming of the Lord shall not prevent them uh, which are asleep, for the Lord himself shall descend from heaven with a, uh, a shout and with the voice of the archangel and with the trump of God, and the dead in Christ shall rise first. Uh, then we which are alive and remain shall be caught up together with him in the clouds to meet the Lord in the air, and so shall we ever be with the Lord. Now this is going to take place, and then the regathering of Israel is going to start, and there, that's where, you know, that's the dividing line that we're going to head up, and then they're going to come in. Somebody said that, that the it's like ball game, you know, the, 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 the Israelites or the Jews were the main uh, ball player in the Old Testament. And then right there, the church age, uh, we came and the Gentiles came. And, and so the Jews are set aside for a while. And then when the tribulation begins, they are the major uh, ball players in that event there. And we'll be gone, we'll be out in heaven uh, during that time. Alcohol. I shall uh, go to uh, Deuteronomy chapter 30. If you can uh, find it, otherwise just write it down. Uh, chapter 30 and verse um, 3 through 5, or less. And then the Lord uh, thy God will turn thy captivity and have compassion upon thee and will return and gather thee from all the nations whither the Lord thy God has gathered thee, if, if any of thine be driven out unto the uttermost parts of heaven, from thence will the Lord thy God gather thee, and from thence will he fetch thee. And the Lord thy God will bring thee into the land which thy father possessed, thou shalt possess it, and he will do thee good and multiply thee, Above thy fathers, a dini da de ya, Jew, a ya, Tanos ka, Tabat and Oskar, and they and her son, but they hold out at a call a hand, they sleep no car, hard seat, a call to a dict, quite not in the quite feast of trumpets or yaki, a del ne, a bepe, hat no, a hina ilta. So, I don't I have uh, uh, other verses that I like to read, but uh, uh, probably uh, uh, Ezekiel 37, 1 through 28, there's a whole chapter that will be the concerning the, the land of Israel. And uh, so up to here, I believe we're in this, uh, in, in, in uh, we're going to see we're going to be part of this. A quotient in Hodor, this quotient in Hi, a Tatahuini, Glad, or the Quadol, the Hot Hodor, and uh, so the sixth trumpet is going to be the, the Day of Atonement, or the Yehas Tragon, the Enna in Nihina, and the Enigi Aya, the Day of Atonement. So, a back in 22 says, uh, uh, things. Those which the prophets and uh, Moses did say should come, 
that was to remind the people of God what Christ will do for Israel concerning their future restoration as a nation at Christ's second coming. And that's uh, the phase two of his coming. The first phase is uh, when uh, he comes for us. And so uh, restoration is going to take place. And uh, that, that, that's going to be true. And uh, so uh, what a day that will be for them. And, uh, and that will be a good day. And uh, our, our time is going to come in again after that. Uh, right uh, at the end of the last uh, trumpet, uh, the last feast. Uh, and then we'll go to uh, Matthew 24, 30, or less. Uh, the, uh, and, the, uh, and then shall appear the, the sign of the Son of Man in heaven. Then shall all the tribes of the earth mourn, and they shall see the Son of Man uh, coming in the clouds of heaven with the power and great glory. And he shall send his angel with the great sound of trumpet, of a trumpet, and they shall gather together his elect from the four winds, from uh, one end of heaven to the other. And so, uh, you know, the Revelation chapter 1 starts with, uh, they shall see him. Uh, man's going to see him. Look, right now, we don't see him. We believe his book. We believe his work. We, we believe that he saved us. But uh, when he comes again, every eye shall see him. Uh, Zechariah chapter 13 says that they, they will mourn because they will see the wound. They will see the, the nail print and they will uh, know that they have uh, put this uh, Savior uh, on the cross and they will uh, feel pity for themselves, uh, what, how they mistreated their Savior. And, uh, and that, that's the day that's going to be coming soon. And uh, so that, that's the day of atonement, yeah? Hey, Israel, hey, yeah, hey, 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 A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-A-
and then the, 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 the saints of God will be in the rulership. And that's what uh, we, we see there. Oh, even in Jodikat, uh, I hope you get something out of that. You know, the first thing I told you was that uh, there is uh, salvation, and then two is sanctification, three is unity, four is our resurrection, and then the fifth is uh, a regathering of Israel, but are we going to be headed out in the rapture? Of course, the thing that I would like you to, to take notice is uh, what uh, Paul said here in Acts 22, uh, 26, verse 2. He said, I count, I think myself happy. Are you happy? Are you happy because you're saved? Are you happy because you know you're going to heaven? Are you happy because uh, nothing can... Uh, uh, change you, nothing can uh, put you out of uh, uh, God's way, and uh, it's always right. You know, that's uh, what I, uh, you ought to see. And then he said, it's incredible. In verse uh, number, verse 8, he said, uh, why should it be thought a thing incredible with you that God should rise from the dead? You know, this guy, uh, Agrippa knew all the story. He knew what the, the Israelite did. He knew the, the story behind each event. He saw it, and uh, uh, Paul said, Why is uh, so unbelievable that you can't come to know him? Why is it so hard for you not to come to know him? Just like us, maybe grandma is saved, maybe brother is saved, maybe neighbors are saved, friends are saved. Why isn't it that we're not getting saved? ตุยติตลาสอายบะหัตอาจะชอบหัตลาพอเอากอติกัดโคนิโซกัสีหัวหน้าหอดเอ๊ะนิฮินาลันฮิเชตันตายอสลาเนฮิตะนิมายาสน
pay for your own sin, but Jesus paid for you because he died in your place. Believe that, accept that, and ask uh, him to save you. So uh, we thank you, Lord, Heavenly Father. We thank you again for this hour. Pray that everything will go well today. We thank you, for we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you.